is about cross belt drive a derivation i am doing it a dme2 concept belt drives these are the driver pulley and driven pulley this is a cross belt drive these are the belt which moves over that of the pulley in this way the belt will moves over that of the pulley in the cross belt drive in the cross belt drive the directions are in opposite direction the rotation of the shaft will be in opposite direction because of this belt let us consider this is a o1 o2 it forms a smaller angle alpha alpha because the belt touches here this will be alpha smaller alpha alpha here the belt touches here alpha alpha and this we call as a t tire and this is nothing but t tires t tires what is t tire the angle of contact of larger pulley or t tire straight tires the angle of contact of smaller pulley and go for naming a b c d e f and a the center distance between the both the shaft will be c capital c Central distance between the two shaft will be C. Let us consider exactly parallel line, parallel line, exactly parallel to here. I just extend this part here in this way. Exactly parallel to this one. Which is parallel to AC. And this point I'm called as a G, which is 90 degree. 90 degree. This is required for the derivation purpose. And if, if this angle is alpha, then this angle is also becomes alpha. D is the diameter of the smaller smaller pulley. Capital D is the diameter of larger pulley. C is the central distance between the two shaft or pulleys. And and alpha is the smaller angle. What is theta s? Theta s is nothing but 180 plus 2 alpha or pi plus 2 alpha from the diagram. This will be 180. Then the 2 alpha will be added here. This one alpha, this one becomes 2 alpha. For theta l, the same 180 plus 2 alpha or pi plus 2 alpha. This is a, I will call this a equation 1 or A equation B. Equation B. Next, from figure, from figure, now O to G. O to G can be written as what? O to G can be written as O to A, O to A plus O2, sorry, O2 A plus AG, O2 A, AG. Now O2 A is nothing but what? O2 A is nothing but R, capital R. This is the diameter radius. For this one, it becomes smaller R. Plus AG, AG is nothing but this part. It becomes smaller R, capital R, this part, smaller part. This becomes smaller r. In terms of diameter, it is written as d plus d divided by 2. This is O to G. Equation C. Equation C. Now, from figure, we have to find out the length here. The length of the belt. Total length, L is nothing but length AB plus length AB plus arc length BCD arc length 
b c d plus length plus length d e plus arc length arc length d sorry arc length e f a e f a arc length arc length now as per the diagram ab is equal to de and de is also equal to ong ong ab is equal to de and this ab is equal to ong from the diagram therefore 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 from triangle from triangle i'm considering this part as triangle here this part o2 o1 and g 90 degree this becomes alpha from the right angle triangle from the right angle triangle it can be written as what this is this is o1g this is a this is b this is c that is a square plus b square is equal to c square right angle triangle now a, b, a is nothing but here o1g square plus o2g square is equal to o1 o2 square right angle triangle i'm using it now here o1g square is equal to o1 o2 square minus o2 g square now this becomes further what is o1 and o2 it is a distance between this o1 and o2 is nothing but c c square minus o2 g is nothing but equation c substitute here d minus d divided by sorry d plus d divided by 2 whole square go for root o1 g is equal to root root c square minus d plus d divided by 2 whole square whole square now what is o1 and g o1 and g is nothing but here de what is d this is nothing but ab from this one we got this part we got the length now we have to find out the arc length arc length we have to find out arc length arc length arc length b c d b arc length for b c d what is arc length here the arc length for b c d is nothing but theta s into r arc length e f a becomes theta r into capital r theta l into capital r from the diagram theta l into capital r this is the arc length now everything has to be substituted in equation i am consider this is equation 1 put in equation 1 this values has to be put in equation 1 in order to obtain the length this become root c square minus d plus d divided by 2 whole square plus theta s r plus root c square minus d plus d by 2 whole square plus theta l r this is become this will be added here l is equal to 2 root c square minus d plus d divided by 2 whole square and theta l r plus theta s r from the diagram from figure we know that theta l is equal to theta s is equal to theta why now see the equation a and b pi plus 2 alpha pi plus 2 alpha theta s and theta l the contact area the angle of contact will be 
same. Therefore, I will consider it theta here. It will be same. Now replace theta L and theta S with respect to theta. Now L will be 2 will be multiplied inside. It become 4 C square minus 4 B plus D square divided by 4. This and this cancel and this becomes theta R plus small r theta. L is equal to root 4 C square minus D plus D whole square plus R divided by R theta will be common. Further can be written as L is equal to root 4 C square minus D plus D whole square plus theta by 2 capital D plus small, uh, small d capital D plus small d capital D plus small d in terms of diameter I am writing it. Now we have to find out this is the formula length of the sorry length of the belt. Now we have to find out the angle of contact. Angle of contact. Now what is the angle of contact we have to find out. From figure from figure I will consider a triangle here. Same triangle I will consider O1, O2 this is alpha, this is g, this is 90, opposite, hypotenuse, and adjacent. Now sine alpha is nothing but opposite by hypotenuse, opposite by hypotenuse. What is opposite? O2 g divided by O1, O2, O1, O2. Now O to G is nothing but O. O to G is nothing but this is the formula. Substitute here. D plus D divided by 2. O1 and O2 is nothing but the distance between the two shaft. O1 and O2. C. C here. And further written as D plus D divided by 2C. Sin alpha. And further alpha is equal to sin inverse. D plus D divided by 2c. I will consider this equation d. I will consider this equation d. Put equation d in a and b. a and b. Substitute in a and b. This is the value. A and b. You will get the angle contact. That means, as per the diagram, theta L and theta is nothing but theta. Both are equal. Therefore, directly you can consider theta S is equal to pi plus 2 sin inverse d plus d divided by 2c. If you want to convert it degree, just pi by 180 you have to do it. Convert into degree. Uh, radian, sorry, convert into radian. Because contact will be remains same. Theta L is equal to theta is theta. Therefore, theta is nothing but pi plus 2, two, two sin inverse d plus d divided by 2c. This is for in terms of radian. Okay. I am Satosh Gaidankar. Thank you very much.